are live from the NASDAQ market site in Times Square, New York City, right after the NASDAQ opening bell featuring E Plus technology. And now we're here with Mark Marin, Chief Operating Officer of E Plus. Welcome, Mark. Thank you, Bradley. Absolutely. Good morning. Good morning. And thank you for ringing the opening bell this morning as well. Yeah, I'll tell you, it was pretty exciting. Yeah. It was, uh, it was good for, I think, all the E Plus employees. We feel good about what we're building, and that was just a nice culmination of everything we've done so far. Certainly. Now, for all the Facebook viewers, can you tell us a little bit more about ePlus? Sure. Uh, ePlus is a technology company. Uh, trailing 12 months, we've done $1.2 in revenue. We've got about 1,074 employees. We've got over 30 offices throughout the U.S., and we've got an international presence in the U.K. Uh, we, we help customers uh, with their data center, cloud, uh, mobility, data analytics, all while providing the security and services they need to install, implement, and optimize these solutions. That's wonderful. So now you celebrated today your 20-year listing anniversary on NASDAQ. What, what does this day mean for you and the company, and is there a special message that you'd like to share with the employees who may be watching back at home um, who, who helped the company get to this momentous occasion as well? Yeah, I, th I think it's great. So first, first off, being on NASDAQ is actually something that from a branding and from awareness is, is very cool for everybody at E+. And for the E+, employees, what we've accomplished over the years and the culture that we have, we feel is second to none. So we think you know, being here 20 years on NASDAQ is, is a nice accomplishment. We've got another 20 or more years to go for sure, but this has been a nice uh, first 20 years. Now, at the end of 2015, you acquired IGX uh, to enhance your security offerings. What can you additionally tell us about that acquisition, and how is that integration going thus far? Sure. So uh, for us at uh, E+, uh, trailing 12 months, 16% of our adjusted gross billings were in security. So we've made a major initiative to build out our security expertise. IGX uh, helps us do a couple different things. One, they build out our security offerings and expertise. They build out our footprint in New York and New England. They give us our first international presence in the UK. So we now have the ability to uh, not only sell for, to our US customers, we have UK customers, and we can go back and forth the Atlantic supporting customers that are not just US based. So it's a, it's a great ad for our security, and it's a great ad for what we can sell that we've always sold with E+. That's, so, so shifting then from the technology to one of your recent accolades that the company received uh, in April of this year, E Plus was named among the 200 or the 2016 Tech Elite 250 list uh, by CRN, the channel uh, of the channel company. What does this selection mean for you and E Plus? Well, it's it's uh, it's just another way to validate what we're doing that we're moving in the right direction. So it, it's always good to be recognized either by your peers or by the industry. So this is just another nice recognition for all the employees at E Plus and the work that they do. Certainly. And then from a uh, chief operating officer's perspective, um, what does it mean for you uh, to have this partnership with Nasdaq? Um, you know, have you been able to kind of sync up with other? Uh, people in your position and and uh, kind of vibe with them on, on different yeah. things that, that are relevant at your position. Yeah, I, here, here's what I tell you. So first off, if NASA can introduce us to every company on NASDAQ, that would be super, but we haven't seen that one yet. <laughs> uh, but in terms of some of the introductions and meetings we've had, they've been great. Uh, so NASDAQ, you know, from an awareness branding has been fantastic. And just being associated with NASDAQ has been great for E+. Certainly. So, just before we wrap, we, we do have um, a great deal of young generation or millennial audience uh, that watches our live feed every day. And we would love to know, um, because the ambition theme is kind of our ethos here at NASDAQ, yep. um, speaking to a younger generation, what advice would you give to that next generation of you know, expiring entrepreneurs and chief operating officers? Sure. Um, and, and so that they can ignite their ambition. Sure. As well. So for, for the younger audience, believe it or not, at one point I was younger. It may not look it, but at one point I was, right? Still 29. Still 29, yeah, multiple times over, right? <laughs> uh, but here, here's the biggest thing that I would tell you is hard work and ambition will get you wherever you want to go. And, and there's one favorite saying that I've always had is, don't be afraid to chase your dreams. You just might catch one. And, and if I were a youth today, the biggest thing I'd tell you, you know, with hard work and really focusing on what you do, you can pretty much do whatever you want. That's great. That's great advice to leave yeah. our viewers with. Mark, thank you for Bradley, being here thank today. Thank you. We appreciate it's been it. Awesome. Next time we'll have to play some basketball. We'll anytime, anytime you're ready. I think I got that. you. I can pack you down. <laughs> <laughs> thank you everybody for watching today, and hope you enjoyed the opening bell as well as our post bell interview with Mark Marin, COO of E Plus Technology. Thank you.